guys welcome back to my channel just wanted to pop in here and show my face this video will be a study with me video currently I am doing lab online just two weeks ago I was in the classroom but I'm just going with the flow it's not bad but I can't say that I like it because I'm not getting any hands-on experience but it's not bad um so like I said, I'll be doing a study with me video, so in the few, next few clips, I'll be just showing you what I do to study. I have an exam this upcoming Tuesday, so it's my first test for this this quarter, and kind of nervous because it's online. Everything's online. Whatever. So, um, stay tuned. In the Notability app, I separate each class into its own separate folder, and then each folder includes all of the PowerPoints. So while I'm in class, I usually just make any notes on the side, anything that the teacher emphasizes, and then any notes that I've found on my own from the textbook as well. I personally like to type my notes up. Um, and just put them all in one document. I use Google Docs, that way I can access my notes anywhere, whether it's on my phone or another computer. Basically what I'm doing here is copying the information that I see that's on the PowerPoint. I also like to open up the original PowerPoint on my laptop and have it side by side with my notes because the professor sometimes adds little notes on the bottom of the PowerPoint, so sometimes they're beneficial. If there's no notes, then I'll just go to my iPad and copy whatever additional notes that I have. and I'm just making notes on a whiteboard. sums up all of the chapters and it has questions at the end so I really like this book so right here I'm adding another table a one by one table and I'm changing the color reason being is because the dark color is for the main title and then the lighter color is for its subtitle. I used to use Quizlet before typing my notes and I have nothing against Quizlet but this method works way better for me so I will continue to type up my notes.
So these are my completed notes. I underlined and bolded any important things. I also added any important figures that I found in the book or within the PowerPoint. enjoy this video and if you haven't already please subscribe thanks for watching